guys, I'm just off to the shops, but I thought I'd make this video because I saw something that got me thinking. So, um, as you can tell from the title, I guess I'm going to talk a little bit about, you know, when we say God speaks to us, what does that truly mean? Um, I was on a certain girl's page and she wrote something or she wrote something along the lines of the Holy Spirit personally approves everything that she wears um, and that how, you know, she would never wear it if the Holy Spirit says she shouldn't. And that sounds really well and good and I, it's a great practice and I encourage girls to do it. However, um, I was looking at some of her pictures and stuff like that, recent ones, um, and so as not to sound too judgmental or anything like that, but some of the stuff that she was wearing, they weren't decent um, for a godly woman to wear. Um, and it really got me thinking about the exclusivity that we place on the word of God in our lives. The truth is, is that the Lord confirms his word. The Bible says that there's safety in the multitude of counsellors. Um, so when we have this exclusive view of, you know, God told me or God said this to me personally, why not ask someone to check it? Why not ask a godly woman in your church, an older woman, you know, what do you think about my outfit? Or even when it comes to stuff like taking a job, university education, and you believe that you've heard the voice of the Lord, why not ask somebody else? Like, um, you know, to confirm it. I'm not one of those people that, you know, I believe in prophecy. I believe in words of knowledge, word of wisdom. I believe that the Holy Spirit speaks. That's very much in my theology um, and my view of God. However, it's so important to also know that he doesn't speak contrary to the word of God. So it's also good to cross check, you know, you believe you've heard something and oppressing and leading on your heart to do something. Why not check that it's consistent with scripture? Check that other people agree as well. I don't want us to fall into a place where um, we have this exclusive view on, um, on the word of God or exclusive view on, you know, God said or the Holy Spirit said that we fall into error with everybody doing what is right in their own eyes as we see. That's what happened to the children of Israel. So it's very important for us to check cross check and check with the bible when it comes to these matters um i hope that serves as a good encouragement and caution to us um when, when we say god said it's good to make sure and it's good to check